Evelyn Duenas says she lost her temper and had an outburst at an August 2017 Guam Regional Mass Transit Authority meeting. The recording of the meeting and the outburst making its rounds to the media before Duenas' confirmation hearing Thursday at the legislature. Duane is telling KUAM News she was upset because a complaint about her was brought before the board in the public comment part of the meeting. Now she maintains that complaint should have been confidential and routed through the agency's customer service reps. While she's sorry for her outburst, she says she was frustrated because the Mass Transit Board allowed her name and the complaint against her, which, according to the recording, involved Duane allegedly threatening a driver to be released publicly. And she says they did it because she has a record of fighting for improved services for transit riders. Duaneus, born with cerebral palsy and has been an advocate for persons with disabilities, serving on many boards and commissions. The word I would use in a training is assertiveness. I took it on that level first and then from assertive it went to aggressiveness. So, you know, it really was not appropriate for me to do, but at the same token, too, it just was... Uh, it was a lot of frustration, and they just allowed it to continue to happen. You better get out! Get out of my way! Don't tell me to shut up! Get out! You people are sticking those hands on my freaking business! I apologize for what I have said. It shouldn't have gone that far. I left it as water under the bridge, you know, but of course they knew they heard that um, my, my, they saw my confirmation uh, at the legislature, of course, and, you know, it, it bothered them, and, you know, I guess this is where it's at now. Duenia says it's no secret she's rubbed GRMTA the wrong way over the years, even drawing a suspension from paratransit last year. But she says she's passionate about improving services, something she tells KUAM she'll bring to the table if she's confirmed to the Mass Transit Board. I speak up literally not for me, but uh, for the community as a whole because I know how the, the, you know, I'm familiar with the system. I've been writing for 35 years now, so uh, this is the worst it's ever gotten. Ironically, while we interviewed Duaneus, she was called by GRMTA and told she'd have to wait three hours to be picked up, something she says is an indication the transit has not been a GovGuam priority for years. Transit was left in the back burner, and it, it included, uh, you know, many people that had the authority to make changes but didn't make the changes. For Guam's News Network, Chris Barnett reports.